My market is different. My market is different. Perhaps you can relate. You're like, yeah, my market's different. I work with Latinos. You know, they're all about the lowest price or I work with uh, Vietnamese. They were, they're all about the lowest price or, you know, I work with Polish people or I work with, you know, Ukrainian people or I work with Russian people or whatever the case is. I work with, you know, the tech industry. Uh, I'm in, uh, you know, Silicon Valley. These people, my market's different. Sure, there might be some nuances to your market, but everyone has a pulse. Everyone fogs a mirror. Everyone's human. Everyone puts their pants on the same way, one leg at a time. Everyone is trying to get out of pain and into pleasure. Everyone's trying to work smarter, not harder. Everyone wants to get out of their problem and into their solution. And in this particular case, everyone, when it comes to borrowers, everyone's looking for a way to get a mortgage to buy a house if indeed they're planning on buying a house. If they're wanting to buy a house, then they need a mortgage unless they have enough cash to buy it cash. But obviously very low percentage of people have that kind of money, especially with this crazy seller's market. So the rules of psychology are the same regardless. It doesn't matter what your market is. And the cool thing is, if you have the secret sauce to build a stable of top producing realtors who make you their exclusive, who send you, who send you one, two, three deals a month, you don't need many of those to push the needle on profit and performance at a pretty dang high level. Like chances are, if you had five to 10 top producers sending you one, two, three deals a month, you're making 300 to $700,000 plus per year, just from that alone. It's not including everything you already have going on if you already have a book of business. So it doesn't take many of those. You know what that is? That's like 15 to 25 well-orchestrated, well-executed meetings using our secret sauce method. We're not talking backflips here. It's, this is not rocket science. But again, if you don't know the formula, you could be you could do meetings till you blue in the face and never crack the code on this, never thread the needle on this. But your your market is not that different than anyone else's market. Everyone's in the seller's market. Everyone's basically got you know offering great rates and great service. So what's going to differentiate you is not in you making the excuse that your market is different because if that is what you're thinking, I'm here to tell you that's mind trash that will take you out of the game. Because if you think your market's different, you're always going to be coming up with nuances and distinctions and loopholes that has you not taking action, that has you, you know, pushing back and say, yeah, but yeah, that might work for you. Yeah, but my market's different. Yeah, that might work for you. Yeah, but my market's different. Well, that's a great way, by the way, to spin your wheels and bang your head against the wall and get stuck in a rut of stagnation. Because instead of doing what champions do, which is asking a more intelligent question, so instead of saying, yeah, but, and powering down, they say, okay, game on, how can I use this in my market? How can I apply this in my market? Now you're shifting from thinking like a chump to thinking like a champ. Now you're thinking from a powered down perspective to a power up perspective. Now you're going to tap into your innate, innate resources, gifts, talents, abilities, genius, and you're going to come up, come, you're going to find a way to apply the principle to your market. So instead of it being a yeah, but it's a game on instead of a power down, it's a power up. So the mind trash there that I want to highlight is your market is really not that different. You still have realtors who need your help, who have clients who need your help. You still are in a market where people are getting into the market, they're moving up in the market, they're getting married, and they're dying. And all those require transactions. And all those are tied to specific referral partners. Your market is not different. Your market is the same as any other market from those principles. Will there be nuances to your approach in how you speak with a top producing realtor versus a bottom feeder or a newbie? Absolutely. But frankly, I don't even recommend talking with bottom feeders and newbies. Let's just go straight to working with the top dogs that have the most business, the most influence, the most clout, the biggest database, and the most amount of business to send you. I mean, let's not step over dollars to pick up dimes. Let's focus on what's going to take you shortest path to the cash. If you'd like to learn more about how we can help you create a breakthrough in your business, I invite you to take advantage of a complimentary breakthrough coaching session. 
at mortgagemarketingcoach.com forward slash apply. On the call, we'll give you crystal clarity on where you are now, where you want to be, and how you can get there faster, shortest path to the cash without messing around doing it the hard way. And if we can help you create that breakthrough, by all means, we will show you how. If not, frankly, we'll be the very first people to advise you to pass on our services. But either way, our goal for you is you leave the call with massive value and massive clarity. So go ahead and book a call at mortgagemarketingcoach.com forward slash apply. Again, that's mortgagemarketingcoach.com forward slash apply.